Greetings everyone and welcome to White Falcon Place. Today we're trying Army of Ruin. This is another arena survival game. But uh, the graphics seem a little bit more um, cus customized on point better than the other ones that we've played so far. So that's um, promising. I haven't really looked into what else is different. Um, so we're just jumping straight in blind and seeing how we go here. We're going to go over the filed graveyard because that's all we can do. Um, oh, let's just we'll quickly have a look. Right, we got upgrades as standard, extra health, recovery, size of projectiles, etc. Um, you've got unlocks, which is kind of cool. So we get new weapons and trinkets. So we'll have a look at all those. And then we've got challenges, which seem kind of cool, but they look kind of standard challenges. It's just earn a certain amount, it's not like use a specific weapon only on the whole run. That'd be kind of cool, bringing in a few of those. Where you can only use one weapon or something and it's quite difficult to survive, but... Let us go into the Defile of Graveyard. Number one. Um, we've got two people. We've got a mage. Magic staff shoots a magic bullet pellet against the closest enemy. Eight pel uh, magic pellets around you. I think that's a special ability, which uh, is on a cooldown. Then we've got invulnerable and deal damage to enemies you touch for 7.5 seconds. Decent amount of time. Let's go with uh, Quicksilver Spears. Ari, uh, what is it? Ari, Arena. Alright, let's do it. Wave 1. Okay, so you can move with the joypad and stuff. Just using mouse and keyboard. It looks like we have to be aiming these, so it's going to be a bit more difficult. Okay, so this is going to be very difficult if I'm using a... Wow, okay. Maybe I should have went to the other character. <laughs> we'll work it, we'll work it. Skill ready. So that makes us invulnerable. How do we use that skill? Should have worked that out, shouldn't I? Let's have a quick look how we use that skill. Controls. Skill is A. I'm not sure if it is. Keyboard. Here we go. Skill is spacebar. Okay. Let's do it. Let's take all these guys out. Just run through them. Uh, crawling root. A powerful shot aimed towards a random enemy. Pierces shot in a horizon vertical pattern. Or extra health. Let's go with the trident. That kind of feels like our character's movement. Okay, cool. That's kind of cool because we've got a, a sideways action as well as a horizontal and vertical. Quicksilver spears. Extra damage. Creates a fireball gravita gravitating around you. Just upgrading one of our actual items we've already got. This could be problematic later, though. I can see how the controller would be quite good at turning at the right time. So you can see our cooldown of our big special here. It's a decent size. But yeah, you can see the graphics look kind of cool. I like it. I have no idea if they're custom assets or not. I hope so. But, um, yeah, very cool. Nothing against non-custom assets, like if you're a single dev put trying to create a game, then it's it's fair enough. Um, size increase, that sounds pretty good. Just attack size in general. Let's do the golden trident. Trident. Okay, going, going okay so far. So when, when our special hits off, we'll just run into the boss and see what happens. We're about to get uh, overwhelmed here. Skill ready. Alright, space bar it is. Oh, that is a strong ability, guys. Uh, 10 increase. Yeah, yeah, we'll get some boots of speed. What's in a box? Oh, look at the cool graphics. Rewards. Piercing uh, is now 2. Cooldown is decreased. It's pretty cool. 
Yeah, we can see it's going quicker. Oh, got hit. Oh, we got the ghost going through. Oh, yep, that's gonna hurt. Where's my health? Okay, down there. Fair enough. Let's grab some coinage. Uh, create electrical pools around you. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. All right. The graphics kind of remind me of, um, right there. Now I gotta remember the name. Uh, Torchlight. Kind of cool. I'm sure there's thousands of other games that it reminds other people of. Oh, Golden Chalice. Just extra money for unlocks, I guess. Unless there's a shop or something as well. A bit of a watermelon. Pac-Man food. Don't know how strong the um those electrical waves are. Skill is ready. Is that gonna stay up the whole time? Because it kind of gets in the way a little bit. Oh no, it's not. Alright, experience gained. How early are we? Like this could be good, but we'll go we'll go with this for now. I don't know how many skills there are actually. Let's grab all these quickly. Uh cooldowns. Extra speed again. Cooldowns be good. How how do I know how long my skill is active? I wonder if I'll have to check next time it comes up. The Lich King. <laughs> now what is he? Um, I can't remember what the guy's called. Some more money. Where's our money kept? Oh, what's what you're doing? Oh, there. 164. Is that explosive? Just a standard barrel? Yeah, okay. I like the uh, special abilities because that's definitely kind of getting out of bad situations. Two shots. Increase size by that much? That's heaps. Yeah, that's cool. Uh oh. We've been surrounded. Yeah, kind of cool, kind of cool. Can these be opened? No. Our skill is ready. Let's let's go and have some fun. Open some boxes. So we get both of those. Cooldown, decrease size, increase slightly. Plus 30% experience. Nice. Okay, I can see it. I can see it. Here it is. Uh, cooldowns even more. I wonder if that increases our... Um, ultimate cooldown as well they really want me to pick this i wonder if there's only four skills to start with and then we unlock more no well there is not necromancer's gauntlets let's get cooldowns for starters all right our special's gone but we've wiped out a big area here how much how many coins do we get from one of these one okay well well, that's not much. What is what is this? Telling me to grab it. Freezes everyone in spots. Okay. Or in in place. Like the old crunch of the um watermelon. Wave six incoming. Reef shots, duration increased. Like it's gonna be good for later. It's got a little bit of knockback on our um on our whatever you call them, spears. How much life is this guy gonna have? Not infinite. I wonder if the meat gives you more HP. I'm guessing the cup maybe gives you ten instead of one. What are these? Oh, that's a broken cup, is it? Broken um, one of these? No. Alright, we've got some other bosses. Was there another boss up here or just the one? Just the one, maybe. 
That's all right. We'll wait for them to get very close, and then we'll um, use our alt. We're surviving okay at the moment. We got we got a whole lot of these guys coming in. Let's um, use our special now then. Just increase all damage by 15%. That seems pretty powerful. There's a little bug or something. I hope they'd go on my coffee. I'm choking in a second. You know why? 15% um, damage or 6% cooldowns. No. Yeah. Um, oh, look. It highlights what it's affecting. That's kind of cool. 15% extra damage is pretty good. On oh, it's blue. I wonder if that... On oh, it's not. Everything's blue. Alright, we got our special. Quick. Go, 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 go. Take this lady out. Weapon and extra damage. That's pretty big. <laughs> Alright, our experience bar is up there. Standard place. Let's go collect all these... Um, blue shiny things all right we should probably get one more skill um powerful shot aim towards a random enemy creates a fireball gravity around it probably this is best i thought it would be always or maybe it is always how much damage does it do 13 oh no it's now and again Gonna have to work out how close these hitboxes are. All right, I'm pro I'm not really happy with the spears out of all the skills I've got. Six, so, they're only doing eight damage. We have update upgraded the other ones a lot though. All cooldowns decreased. Yeah, okay. But the damage was gonna go up on the other ones as well. That's something to think about. Oh, there's a crown. How much does that give? Three eight. Oh, a whole hundred. Take that. Getting hit now and again. Extra. This is a decent amount. So is that. We'll do this one. Okay, these skeletons are pretty hard to kill. But we've got our special. We'll go through. Take out the, the lich. Grab our box. Duration and cooldown. Okay. Excuse me, skeletons. Oh, Jesus. We've got to watch that cooldown. Um, four bullets. Bullet speed. Experience up. Let's get experience up. So we're scholars. Let's go find some health. There's just there was something weird over there. Let's go and um, perch over there a second. What's this thing here? Oh, is that a gravitational puller? Oh. Oh, it's a bad thing happening. Cool. There's a bomb. Everything on the screen explodes. Oh, everything close. It, everything on the screen explodes. It's another grave thing. Interesting, interesting. All right, let's jump through here. So the the money is that an end game thing? Probably. Bullets, experience. Let's just smash this up as best we can right now. What are, is this counting down or up? Counting up. Okay. We're on level seventeen. We've only got a tiny bit of damage. Our uh, major skill is ready. Oh, what's up here? Is there anything special over the gates? That's something I think they could they could do in some of these games is have specific areas that you could go in as little challenges or something, um, which gives you some bonus somehow. Just to add some extra 
encouragement to explore and do other things. We can always use our spell if we want, which we can. Just jump through all these. Cooldowns or damage up? Let's go damage up again, make sure we kill everything. Alright, it's going to end, let's move out the way. There's a lot of stuff over here, but we've also got a lot of walls. What's this thing over here? Probably a bad thing. Oh, it slows us down. Oh, okay. That's kind of cool. Got to be aware of our surroundings as we're moving around. I like that. Experience up again. We probably should increase some of our weapons as well though. Like everything is good. Oh. The final wave. Okay. I shouldn't have got so many experiences then. Uh, just increase damage by everything. So our major special isn't up yet, but I feel like this is okay. He's going very, very slowly. He must have multiple waves, maybe? Multiple uh, phases. That'd be cool. Oh, and extra enemies. Our skill is ready. Wonder how quickly our skill would would work. We'll find out in a second. All right, here we go. Or oh, decent, but we've got to get through here. I think it's getting a little bit hectic. We got oh, we got to see, got to keep trying to hit him at the same time. There's a tree in the way though. But if we keep moving away, we're not going to get any of our uh, coins either. Trying to circle around quickly. Because we've got a lot of coins over here. This could level up. Where's my health? Okay. Let's get more damage or cooldowns. Very damage. gonna quickly grab all these it's probably a bad idea because we're gonna get killed over there it's the other thing you fall into that rhythm of like oh go go and collect that all those experience over there and then you're just creating more trails of experience as you go got the fly thing my skill is ready so that's awesome um, see, this is quite good in this area, I guess, but we'll grab this one and then we'll just jump through here, start smashing. He's get he's getting down. We're getting here. An avocado, just what I wanted. Actually, I don't really like avocados. They're fine, but not my go-to treat oh we're screaming he's close we got some more pots around here oh he is dead our victory is ours pretty cool actually don't mind that oh we got a little map of what we did Look how big the whole map is. I didn't even explore that much of it. Maybe I did. I like the little extra map thing. Okay, I did go around quite far. There we go. What I used, etc, etc. All my rewards. Unlocks. Oh, we got throwing axes. Melee attack with great reach. Didn't we already have that? Or maybe we unlocked it for other classes. Raven wing. Plus 25% health and damage, but minus experience. That's cool. So gains and bo uh, boons and cons, whatever. I'm trying to say. Extra money gained. 
Okay. So upgrades are money. Yes. Actually, they're quite cheap. I guess the first one's cheap. Yeah. Doubles. Oh, everything goes up. No, is it? Yes. Okay. Oops. All right. So that's that there. Upgrades. I, re I, I really like the upgrade tree of the spirits game. I can't remember what it's called now. Um, but where you kind of unlocked on a tree. That was really cool. I like that. And very visually appealing. Whereas this is, this is fine. Um, but yeah, I just like the other one better. Upgrade 500. Oh, no, I just want to go back. Escape. And then I unlock. So we've, we've started to unlock some stuff. A feature. Okay. That'd be interesting to see what they're about. And then challenges. Just, yeah, standard stuff. Okay. So we unlocked all those in that run. And then the characters. So we could do that three times. Upgrade crawling route to level four. I didn't even see that. And reach experience level 20 with Arena. What level were we? Like if we, if we can't reach that level before the game ends. Okay. All right, we might, yeah, I think we'll give us a couple more goes. See if we can unlock a couple of characters and stuff. So there we go, guys. Army of Ruin. Um, pretty cheap as well on, on Steam. I'll put the link in the description. Um, and yeah, quite quite like it. Like the graphics. They look cool. Um, it's got a few new things to it, but all the other, all the old stuff as well. Um, so yeah, we'll, uh, we'll play a little bit more of this a bit later. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time. White Falcon out.